Secondary hypothyroidism. Causes of secondary hypothyroidism. A major cause of hypothyroidism is known as autoimmune thyroid disorder. This occurs when a person's immune system malfunctions and begins to attack the thyroid gland. This is sometimes referred to as Hashimoto's thyroiditis and can be present with other autoimmune disorders such as fibromyalgia. Due to these complicating factors, it can become difficult to diagnose hypothyroid disorders. Risk factors may be a result of a tumor on or near the hypothalamus gland or the pituitary gland can also be caused by radiation to the brain or anywhere near the hypothalamus or pituitary gland. Another cause can be extensive blood loss, as in during childbirth, which in turn causes low blood flow and can result in infection of the pituitary gland. This is a condition known as Sheehan syndrome. Infection of the pituitary gland. More rarely, certain viral illnesses can cause damage to the pituitary gland either through inflammation or iron deposits which are created due to the illness. Symptoms of secondary hypothyroidism. Fatigue or a general listless feeling. Unintentional weight gain. Increased sensitivity to cold. Noticeable thinning and brittleness of fingernails or hair. Heavier periods than normal. Pain in muscles or joints. Weakness and overall tired feeling. Depression. Unusual dryness or paleness of one's skin. Constipation. Treatments for secondary hypothyroidism. Most commonly, a thyroid medication called levothyroxine, Synthroid, is prescribed. Doctors usually prescribe the lowest dose they can, which will relieve the patient's symptoms effectively. The hope is that it will also bring the patient's TSH range back to normal levels.